good morning friends today we are going to discuss fluid power control unit number 3 see here uh, this is lecture number 7 of unit number 3 objective of our lecture to understand pressure reducing wall sequence wall and their application in fluid circuit outcome of our lecture at the end of session student can understand pressure reducing wall sequence wall and their application in fluid circuit so this is here pressure reducing wall pressure relief wall can you make a the difference this is prv and this is pressure reducing wall See, uh, both have <coughs> wall have tank. Here internal drain. Here also internal drain. Ready the pressure from upstream pump line. Ready the pressure from downstream. This is difference. Ready the pressure from upstream pump line. This is ready the pressure from downstream. See, this is difference in pressure reducing wall or tank. Here we can see. Now we are also we have observed pressure reducing wall diagram shows the pressure reducing wall, and this is picture of the pressure reducing wall. This is see here in picture. This is pistons. This is spring, and this is piston cylinder. See here, pressure reducing wall, adjustable screw, drain line, spring, reduce pressure line. See here, reduce pressure line, main pressure line, no pilot signal. Here, pilot signal. Application of pressure reducing wall. Cylinder one, cylinder two. application of pressure reducing wall cylinder 1 cylinder 2 see here this is now position as uh, starting so this this is also in now position here application of pressure reducing wall see here pressure reducing wall apply here at 100 bar Here PRV at three hundred bar. Here we have applied the pressure reducing wall. Here we have applied the pressure reducing wall. At position one. See here this first position. This cylinder go to the outward or uh, forward direction. And this position, this oil return to the tank by port B to T. In second position, this cylinder goes to the return position, a uh, backward or uh, retard retraction, and this kind of pressure control the hundred bar at here. And this here pressure controlling the three hundred bar means pressure here for this cylinder is three hundred bar and for this cylinder is hundred bar. This is application of pressure reducing wall. Sequence wall is the pressure control wall that is used to force to actuator to open in sequence instead of sending flow back. To the tank, 
However, a sequence for allow flow to a branch circuit when a preset pressure is reached. External drain, see a this is tank. This is tank. When a preset pressure is reached, this is sequence wall. The check wall, non written wall. Sequence wall, we can see a adjustable screw, drain line, spring. And this is piston. Application of sequence wall, we can see here, uh, this is PRV pressure reducing wall 350 bar. Cylinder one, and this is cylinder two. Here, this is sequence wall. External drain, tank, cylinder two, punching cylinder. This is workpiece, clamping cylinder, like that. See here, uh, A and B. At first position, P2A, the clamping cylinder going to with extension and this cylinder also goes to the extension, but after a sequence, after completed this, this cylinder is work, work. This, this is four by three DCV closure center and push button actuations. Parallel configuration. After processing, pressing red button when happened to the circuit. Parallel configuration. Cramping cylinder. Workpiece sequence wall. After present red button, what happened to the circuit? Pump flow in going to cylinder. First, not to cylinder, second to because there is a sequence wall in the line. Sequence wall is closed one and open only when the set pressure at sequence wall reaches in the line pressure. Sequence wall, see this is sequence wall. Parallel configuration after pressing red button, what happened to the circuit? See here. Uh, after pressing this button, this is acting on cylinder. This cylinder goes to the uh, outward side. After that, this liquid goes to the here, like that. Here, first we could check this is non written wall. Here, after that, going to the cylinder sequence wall, punching cylinder and acting like that. The pump flow is going to cylinder one, not to cylinder two, as because there is a sequence wall in the line. Sequence wall is closed one and open only when the set pressure at sequence wall reaches in the line pressure. This wall is open only when the set pressure is open up to this, this uh, cylinder is uh, closed. So this is a sequence operation. Once again, I have explained, see. Sequence wall is closed once open only when the set pressure at sequence wall reaches in the pressure like that. Power source 4 by 3 dcv close center and push button actuation. 
PIV 350 bar tank. Yeah, when the first position pump supply the oil to the first cylinder, clamping cylinder is act as acting, and oil goes to the this pressure here, yeah, pressure fix uh, pressure line, which is <clears throat> for second cylinder at uh, for second cylinder design this wall at some pressure after that reaching pressure this pressure wall with a sequence wall is open and oil goes to the this cylinder like that this sequence operation is work after that parallel configurations After cylinder one is completely extended, hold to workpiece, then pressure start to building in the, the line and make the pressure in the line is more than the pressure setting as the sequence wall. Then this pressure acting and cylinder start to go downward. Immediately sequence wall open and allow the flow to pass through it and then to cylinder two, and it start moving downward to the point the work with, like that. In this way, sequence operation is done. Parallel configuration, cylinder two, compress the work piece and complete its task. Then pressure start building in the line until 4 by 3 dcv. Change its position to right position. So cylinder to compress the work piece and complete its task. The pressure start building in the line until 4 by 3 dcv changes its position. Right position as. So once right hand side, the DCV push button is pressed, then flow divert to the both cylinder at the rod end. So both the cylinder retract to stay to the initial position. Note the fluid present in the head side of the cylinder one is passed to the tank through the return line. While the fluid present in the head side of the cylinder two is bypassed through the NRV sequence wall. While the fluid present in the head side of the cylinder two is bypassed to NRV of sequence wall. Analyze the circuit. Notice the following cylinder is mounted vertically with the rod. It is controlled by 4 by 3 dcv, which is close center and push button actuation wall. See here. This is pressure reducing wall to control the pressure. This is pump like that. This is wet. Analyze the circuit. When the DCV is shifted to the position, cylinder is extend and lower the load. When the DCV is shifted to the position, cylinder is extend and lower the load. Means this position or it goes to in this direction and pressure apply on this piston, this weight goes to the extend and lower the load. As we know that the velocity of the cylinder is based on the flow rate V equal to Q by A, it, is it happens here? No, as because cylinder is accelerating very quickly with the flow rate and head side and the heavy weight attached at the rod end. So the weight is driving the cylinder and causes the cylinder to accelerate too quickly. This can cause the damage to the rod or even to the cylinder itself when the rod is stopped quickly at the end of the travel. This can be 
remedy remedied by placing a counter balance wall on the rod end of the cylinder at seen in figure in this figure we have seen like that and or uh, analyze this circuit so any doubt any queries please ask me thank you so in this way we have studied pressure reducing wall which is symbol difference between read the pressure from upstream here yeah, read the pressure downstream after that sequence wall this is sequence wall application of sequence wall parallel configuration of the sequence wall circuit analysis c in this way we have studied any doubt any queries please ask me so today we are stop here thank you